This really is just so satisfying to watch. How's it going 3D printers? Andrew Sink here, and today we're gonna to be talking about an idea so great, you're gonna be asking yourself, why didn't I think about that? If you've been 3D printing for a while, you're probably already aware that the best way to store filament is in an airtight bag with some desiccant in it, and this is to prevent the filament from absorbing any moisture and becoming unprintable. Now, typically, that's one of those things that's easier said than done. It's hard to find bags that fit filament, and we usually wind up putting it in whatever we have lying around. So that brings us to the product we're going to be looking at today, which is the Eurus by Ibos. The Eurus is a USB-powered vacuum pump, which attaches to a custom-made resealable bag that has a vacuum valve built right into the side. This lets you pull a pretty tight vacuum that, along with some desiccant inside the bag, should prevent the filament from absorbing any moisture. Ibos is a fairly new company, and their flagship product is the Cyclopes Filament Dryer, which allows you to take a spool of filament and place it inside a heated environment to remove any moisture from that filament. Once our print is finished, we want to take that filament and then place it into a sealed bag to prevent it from absorbing any moisture that we just removed. So with that in mind, we're going to unbox the Euros, and inside we have three bags, each with its own vacuum cap, a little pouch that contains the actual vacuum pump, and the instructions. The instructions are really straightforward. All we have to do is place the filament into the bag, connect the Euros to a USB power supply, connect it to the bag, and then turn it on. So here we can see the pump itself. The bag actually has a really cool feel to it, and I'm definitely impressed with the quality of the packaging. Usually bags like this are a throwaway, but this one's actually pretty nice, and I'm probably going to keep it. As advertised, this is a USB-powered vacuum pump. So here we've got our USB port. This can plug into just about any USB wall adapter. So if you have an iPhone charger, Kindle charger, anything like that, you can just plug it straight in. So we're going to go over the process of actually vacuum bagging some filament. It's really, really straightforward. All we have to do is put the filament into the bag. There's an included clip for running down the seam to make sure that it's sealed tight. After that, we just remove the cap from the vacuum valve and attach the Euros. This just screws right on and you'll know when it's attached because it comes to a stop. And from there, we just hit the power button and you'll notice the air just gets pulled right out and we now have a vacuum. Once you've pulled all the air out of the bag, the removal is just as straightforward as the actual assembly. We just unscrew the Euros and put the valve cap back on. And that's it. So I went back through my filament and found some of the spools that had the worst offenders as far as bad bags go. Some of them were there for moral support only, and I replaced them with the vacuum bags. I feel a lot more confident that this filament's going to last a lot longer now, simply because once I've pulled that vacuum, I don't have to worry about any moisture entering into the bag. The video you're watching here has been sped up. This process takes about a minute from start to finish. Here I've got it condensed down to about 10 seconds. The Eurus isn't available yet, but Ibos is planning on launching a Kickstarter that should be available by the time this video is out. You can find a link in the description if you want to learn more, and you can also find a link to their website to read about the Cyclopes and some of their other products as well. This really is a no-brainer as far as filament storage goes. If you go through a lot of filaments and you have a lot of half-used spools lying around, this is a great way to extend the life of those spools. As always, Thanks for watching and have fun printing.